Twinner, more than you can see. Twinner comes about um, our first experience at API that uh, we started to digitalize parts of the car, mainly the tires and, every, on, and, and suspensions and then such, such things. But also from my experience in digitalizing humans, we figured out there is no available product today to make a full digital car and generate a digital twin out of a car. And that's how we started. We will convert more to a data and platform company uh, because uh, it's not about the hardware itself. It's much more about the digital twin and the main value generation happens on the data level because all parties are more joining a platform. And uh, based on that, we, we sell twins and, and not digitalizing equipment. Our vision is that every car that is existing uh, as an asset will have a digital twin. So if you in future will buy a used car, for example, you don't go there and look around the car. You say to the, to the, to the seller, send me your twin. And that's all what you have to do. We believe the twin app will be a game changer for the market because um, to generate a digital twin will not only happen in the car industry, it will happen with everything around us. It's more efficient to move the data than to move the asset. And other side, in internet-based businesses, information symmetry between buyer and seller is the only long-term business model that will work. So, and we supply these business models with the right data. So we believe uh, that it will be a game changer in the used car market also. One of the major things that we do is we take time and space out of the market. So until now, you have to go to the asset, to the car and look, go around, look, get a feeling about it. In most cases, it's the only thing that you can get. But in future, this asset will come to you at home. So you don't go there, the assets are coming to you because the quality of a twin is so high that you can get much more information sitting on your couch and looking in your iPad than to go directly to the, to the car. And that will change uh, the, the, the basic parameters that, that are done today in the business. So you can do the sales everywhere, anytime. And that is a, is a big change in the whole value chain. Most other markets have image problems because the custom, cu customer and consumer all the time has the feeling that he does not know any, something about the car. And that's also one of the reasons why they start to bargain uh, and, and to reduce the price because they believe there is some risk in, in the deal that they can't touch and they don't understand and see. And therefore there is a trust issue all the time. So. In certain countries, even there is a forum that if you don't get anything, you can you become a car used car dealer, right? So that means they have a serious image problem, and um, and that's all going back on on trust. If you have, for example, a leasing car and you bring the car after three, three years back, um, you have damages on the car that you not even recognize because over three years. I mean, there are some, some small scratches, maybe you, you did also a small bump or something like that. You don't even recognize it. So end of the day, the consumer uh, or the user of the car has to pay it, uh, if, if it's you know something that is not average for three years, it, you have to pay for it. And that is a problem, especially if you are not capable to objectize this. So it's very important, for example, if you take over a car as a user that you generate a twin and you know how you get it. And if you bring it back, how you bring it back. And then you see also difference in it. And you, this is a very objective thing to do. Uh, and we believe this will happen uh, in all types of, um, of uh, situations where you change ownership. And ownership change will happen more often on cars. I mean, if you think about mobility, then you will see that we see much more ownership change than only every three years. I get asked very often, what is a digital twin? And uh, a digital twin is more or less a huge file in that you have all types of data about the asset, the car. And that starts with visual uh, data so that you can see anything in the car, under the car, over the car. It adds a lot of sensor data where we measure um, for example, the age of painting or three-dimensional data to figure out possible damages and so on. And it has um, also data about the history of the car sometimes. 
It has data about which equipment is built in the car. Uh, and it has but it, sometimes also data which valuations uh, are done by uh, appraisal organizations uh, on the car. So that those are all together um, uh, is a huge information package and depending which application you, you are following, you see parts of it. So you, you very often only see a little part of a huge twin. We as company try to, to, to establish at first information transparency between buyer and seller and force trust in the business. So that will uh, result in, in, in more and faster transactions on the used car market. Um, and, and our vision is to enhance the whole market uh, on one side and the other side to reduce costs and the transactions and long term to build an ecosystem and that all the different parties who are involved in a transaction like financing, insurance companies, the dealerships, the OEMs can do that in a fully digital way. The auto market will also change, especially in the used car markets, because today a lot of dealerships have um, in all their stores, even if they have a store, six or seven stores in a, in a city like Denver or so, uh, they offer very often in all these stores used cars, right? But if you take time and space out of the equation, then you will see that we get more and more centralized used car hubs because you can uh, use the space also for new cars and you have all this the stock available on large screens because the quality of twins is so good that you can also convince a customer in front of the screen and if he is convinced um, then you deliver the car to him a growing part will be also ordered online especially especially if we are talking about monthly fees or, so that you don't have to pay down the fifteen thousand dollar uh, you only pay maybe 199 a month so that will change also the whole structure in the market so we will see centralization and concentration on on, on hubs and we will see that the product uh, and the stock will be available everywhere so the car has not to be there uh, where you sell it the twin is created in three steps the first step is the digitalization that's where we what we do in the twin space so that's a uh, a huge measuring chamber, photo studio, analytical system. You drive in and in two times 120 seconds you get a digital twin. Then this twin is transferred to the cloud where we secure this data, we sign it and we add information to it, we enhance it, we tag the features and imperfections. And then in the third step we deliver this data in a product that we call Twinner Showroom. Um, it's a widget that you can include in any shop and in any uh, website by one line of code. Uh, and there the consumer can see in all the details the car, can zoom in, inside, outside, under it, uh, get uh, additional data from the sensors, overpaint and all these things. So more or less three steps, generating the digital twin, enhancing the data, showing the result to the customer. The main advantages of the twin are at first that anything that you see is like it is. What you see is what you get. So there is no difference. So there is not an other car that looks like. That's the unique representation of this one car. Secondly, it's all the time done in the same circumstances. So it's not shadow on it or looks different or the color is different because the light was not good. You see anything also in a way that you couldn't see in a dealership because you can't go under the car. You do not have time to zoom in and everything in the car. You can do that all as a consumer. And the third thing is you get an objective um, qualification and verification for features and imperfections. So for you as a consumer, is it simple to decide is this a car that I want and you get shown everything what is on the car this type of transparency and, and at the same time the, 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 the quality of the product that is transported online uh, these two things make it very um, unique for everybody we started to release Twinner uh, last quarter 2018 
uh, with the first uh, dealerships who are already online uh, fiend and, and uh, interested in digitalization. So those are our first customers uh, and we will enroll uh, with uh, marketing and um, also on a broader market 2019. Uh, at the same time, we also deliver uh, products uh, already in China, so in an international level to make sure that the product or the platform will work everywhere in the world. As a used car dealership, uh, you don't even need in any cases a twinner space because to have an own twinner space makes only sense uh, if you have a, an appropriate volume. Uh, very often, um, you can use a twinner space nearby you uh, because we have uh, more and more service providers who offer digitalization and the recreation of the car uh, at the same time for dealerships who have smaller volume, for example, at a certain location, so that you can uh, have on a couple of locations twinners operated by yourself, but you can also use on smaller locations um, resources from uh, other vendors or from uh, companies who offer the service for you. We have a dedicated operator model. Uh, for example, we are start to run those one with TÜV. And uh, operator means that there's somebody who offers uh, a full service package, like a business process outsourcing for a used car dealership. So if a used car comes back, they take the used car, they clean it, they digitalize it. And with TÜV especially, they're also capable to make evaluation um, services so they can value the damages, they can give you a car uh, valuation back and as a result you get back the car, the twin and the car valuation by TÜV. We are looking for the growth uh, of, of Twinner um, all the time for bright people for our team who, who are hardworking, who like to solve complex problems who, uh, who also see dematerialization of our environment uh, a real challenge and who want to take this challenge and, and, and change the world together with us. Twitter, more than you can see.